Yeah, yeah. Welcome back to this thing. Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. How you doing, David? Me, I'm good. I'm. You know what? This is nice. You, you, you do, you do a bit of talking. I'm playing the game without you bothering me. It's. Really I haven't enjoyable. even been paying attention to the past. Please don't. Just ten watch, minutes of you Just watch play. me walk. I've really got a lot done because you haven't been sitting on my ear, fucking chewing me out the whole time. Yeah, well, um, it's, a, it's a good, it's a good, uh, it's a good uh, plan. Good, good strategy. I just don't pay attention the to the game. Fuck is that? <laughs> it's like look a, how weird that ship is. Yeah, it's just. What the? Dude, you imagine that booster on the right hand side like goes. No, come back. I want to check that. What? That was so rude. <laughs> that was so weird. That's the weirdest ship. I feel like a ship has to be symmetrical to fly properly. Right? The ship would just be spinning. <laughs> but it's space. It doesn't need to be. Uh, like, you still have inertia. Yeah, but... Like, momentum uh, still carries. I guess. That was still a weird ship. Um... Like, something being... Like, it's... Like, things still... Well... Things have mass in space. They don't have a weight, per se, though. Sure. Yeah, because um, space... Right. Nice. No, see, I'm not ignorant of that. I was just gonna say, like, is it the case that as long as you could get going straight, you would keep going straight? As long as you keep, yeah. If well, any direction you're going in, you keep going that direction. Yeah, no, but I mean, insofar as like, um, what am I trying so to? So if ask? you get you, if you get yourself going straight. Well, yeah. What I'm saying dude, is that like, dude, he's 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 selling really expensive. Uh, yeah, I Plus can just go get some from a planet. Galactic um, Caridium. sorry, I, I'm just trying to do Galactic some... Iridium? <gasps> Galactic Galactic oh, average. I don't like, it. I don't like, it's a real small in front nose, though. You should buy it, I have anyway. enough credits, probably. It's probably got, like, nowhere near enough slots, though. Yeah. Look at that weird rope fan just also, rotating. Oh, it's really cool. Um, yeah. I'm also a thesis now to their race. I don't know what that Oh, that's is. good. You're, yeah. you're a fucking PhD. Yeah, yeah, you're a PhD thesis. Uh, let's see how much he wants to sell for. Oh, uh, it's pretty good. It's pretty, pretty decent slots. Well, pretty let's, cheap. Let's compare. Uh, it's got it's got more uh, slots. By you how can, many? Uh, two. You Ugh. current Starship sixteen, new Starship. It's you a just lot. Have to, you just have to delete a bunch of the the weapons on it. It's a lot for. Well, no, we we. I mean, oh, this stuff. Yeah, you'll have to delete that stuff to have more slots. Because uh, your current one is. Yeah, yeah, I see what you mean. Two, yeah. It's a lot for two more slots, though. It, it's a lot of it's a lot of units. I'm gonna try to buy something. I'm gonna try to save up and get a. Bigger one. I mean, I reckon the best. I think because I know you, you can upgrade your uh, exosuit inventory space. Oh, how? If you find upgrades somewhere. Oh. I think it's the same kind of thing where, like, with the uh, the gun, where you find places that sort of replace it. Signal boost. Oh, okay. I'm applying for money. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Whoa. What are you? That's a weird. Yeah. Gross. Weird. Look at how many rockets. Look at those weird shields on this. Oh, that's a weird fucking. Oh, no, I, I, I bet they go down and you become a hovercraft. Or they're just like the sickest fucking subwoofers <laughs> ever. <laughs> He's just got great feet. It's like <laughs> the space <laughs> It's like no one can hear yeah. you scream in space, but everyone can hear your sick beats. Yeah, dude, imagine that. The well, no, yeah, because you wouldn't. Oh you my wouldn't. god, look at how much image, dude! But for a million credits. <laughs> a million credits. Jesus, that's insane. That's bananas. That's insane, dude. dude I respect that's your game. You gotta, that's what oh, you look, gotta get up. This guy's for. got a fucking weird shield too. Is, is that it? just like what's in in this area? Oh, there's another one! Another one just landed! Dude, there's so many of them. Dude, there's so many- Oh, there's a weird mosquito You're, I'm thing. not even gonna look at no, you. No, I'm gonna go to the Duffmobiles. Duff Duffs. Man, that's Dude, they have a lot base. of space. Yeah. Dude, I reckon they would just crank it up. We gotta aim up to that shit. Man. Yeah, they probably just terraform planets by just going down and playing like dubstep at full volume. Is that how terraforming works? Yeah, you just go down and play dubstep at full volume. It's a cool shit. Cool. Oh. Um, is that really how that works? Yeah, that's how you terraform okay. planets. I don't not believe you. I just it just sounds <laughs> of course like it's not. It just you. sounds like bullshit. Uh, um, if Dubstep had that power, Skrillex would rule the world. You know I what wonder I mean? if this What's is kind of just like a theoretical. Sure, thought. go for it. I wonder if those things that are like, if it's like arrive in like ten hours. I wonder if you actually waited the ten hours. Like, if the game would still work. Probably. Because like, part of me thinks that they're not actually. Sort of rendering the entire not rendering they're not actually calculating the distance from things they're just going like oh it's this far but if you boost it's 10 seconds like you're not uh... actually like in the sense that if you're if you're not boosting when you're in space or nearby a planet you're not actually moving you're just placed in this weird say that again so from slower. like a from a programming perspective <laughs> slower, slower though. so you know when you're like you're in the middle of space and it's like 10 hours to the nearest thing. Uh-huh. <sighs> like, my theory is they're not actually calculating, like, they're not saying, like, oh, if you go two hours this way, there's an asteroid belt, or, or if you go six hours this way, there's a 
another asteroid battle or whatever. Like, uh -huh. I, I have a feeling it's just a case of you're just, you're literally at zero, zero, zero. Like, just zero. Yeah. Like, you're at the origin point of the world, of whatever engine they're using. And, like, if you... The zinc if it. you start boosting towards a planet, then it actually takes into account... Then it actually moves you towards a planet... Okay. Because then it's just like, you're actually going a reasonable speed. You're not going a snail's pace towards sure. the planet. Yeah. There was a thing over there to the left. It just disappeared. Yeah. But it's like, I have a feel, because Kerbal Space Program. It was that which, direction, right? Yeah, it was over there somewhere. Yeah. yeah. Well, I need the blue dropper. Yeah. The, uh, the, yeah, it's just up there. Because Kerbal Space Program does something really interesting with that, where they don't, where like, it's, it's like a space game, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. But they don't actually calculate... They don't actually have, like, a map of space, so to speak. Like, they don't keep mm -hmm. that in... They don't have that in the game. They just... They just go, oh, you're this... You're this distance from the nearest thing. And if you start moving at a reasonable pace towards something, it kind of just... Then it generates the world around you. Well, yeah, but that's because that game... Because if you're going at a slayer's pace, you're never going to meet anything. Well, that's because that game in particular, that game runs like an actual simulator for um orbit like the reason that the reason i think they yeah. built it like that is because it, it runs a simulator for orbital distance and stuff so actually distance is based on speed as well i think i think couple space program would do we mind? because it is more of a simulator it probably would actually care about space get rid of you but i think a game like this because this isn't a simulator it's minecraft with multiple planets i don't think we need zinc yeah we do oh it's for 20 the... zinc i got it written down dude oh okay ready um, I've decided that for once I'll be useful and I've started writing stuff down when, awesome. it, when I need it. Yeah. It's... Don't know how long that'll last. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I, I just have see. the feeling that, like, the tech behind this game is a lot... is full of hacks. I mean, it... Yeah. And uh, full of sneaky it, shit. It feels like it must be just based on the amount of, er like, issues they've had. Yeah, well, it just... And the way... The way the game plays, how it... How it says shit, like, ten hours away, and then when you start boosting towards it, it'll just arbitrarily be like... Obviously, because, you know, warp speed kind of shit. Oh. Faster than light travel. Yeah. But it just feels a bit like, mm, yeah, they're definitely doing some hack where if you're just traveling around, it doesn't actually care where you are in space. It just randomly throws asteroid belts at you. Oh, with the asteroid belts. Yeah, for in sure. In particular. Oh, for sure with the asteroid It wouldn't belts. actually be like, oh, there's no, an no, asteroid no, no, no. belt here in particular. It'll just randomly procedurally generate them and throw them at you. No, yeah, yeah. No, that, I, I, I do not doubt that the asteroid belts are completely randomly yeah. generated. Um, Which kind of implies that there's no actual... You can't actually traverse distances between mm -hmm. planets if you're not boosting. Um... I oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, so it's yeah, just rendering the environment around you. Yeah, and the skybox just kind of changes... What the fuck is that? It's green. It's er emerald. Um, oh, right, I don't need yeah. it. I need I need um heridium, but her I thought heridium was the blue one as well. Heridium is the 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 it's, heridium is usually the blue like triangle coming yeah, out. Yeah, I just keep getting rectangle. That that one. Uh, it's, yeah, it's the science one, but like. Yeah, but I keep getting that keeps being silicates. Yeah, because heridium is always in that big like fucking big pillar. Yeah, pillar. We should probably block. just look for it. Yeah. Visual. I don't it think this planet's gonna be have any. Planet, yeah. Because it's a real flat planet. Yeah. Alright, why don't we chip on to a different planet, see if we can find some. Yeah, that might help. I need something with, like, less... I need something with more natural geography. Less red, more green. Well, yeah, like, more, like, less barren, because this planet's particularly barren. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, I see what you're saying. I, I just think it's a case of, like, they, um... I was saying this, I'm talking about something... Because, I mean, the whole 18 quintillion planets Ow. thing is a... Complete fucking well, lie. Someone summarized it perfectly. Don't know who it was. They were like, and this will be a good quote to end the episode on. Um, they were like, yeah, you know that you can you can procedurally generate eighteen quintillion planets, but you can't procedurally generate eighteen quintillion things to do. <laughs> yeah. And I think that's pretty emblematic. <laughs> it's a pretty of this good game. way to, to so put it. See you guys next time.